What's up guys, it's Tanner with OBO and I'm super stoked to present another HubSpot Plus expert insights and hidden gems video. Today is the third video for Breeze, showing you a little bit about Breeze intelligence. And you can find this in the Breeze tab at the bottom left section and you scroll down to explore intelligence. It's right here. I'm gonna show you this section will have data enrichment, buyer intent and form shortening. Unfortunately, there are some things you need for data enrichment in order to upgrade to Breeze Intelligence. So you need to buy monthly credits, similar to what you would do with like Apollo or Seamless AI, something like that, in order to actually enrich the data within your HubSpot. But once you've purchased those credits, you can actually go through all of your contacts and your companies and enrich them directly from your HubSpot. So when you go to a company record, you'll go to the top left about section and it'll have the classic Breeze star for you. And when you click on it, it'll populate all of those fields that you need inside of those properties within your HubSpot directly. You don't have to go anywhere else. So inside of the settings, these are pretty straightforward. You'll have automatically enriched new records. So any new record that come in will be enriched automatically. You can allow records to be manually enriched, which somebody can do, like I just said, with the star inside of a company record or a contact record. And then you can continuously enrich existing records, which means inside of your HubSpot instance, those contacts and companies over time will all be enriched so that everything inside of your HubSpot is completely filled out. You don't have any missing data with any of your contacts or your companies. In the tool section, you can allow the forms to actually work together with your data enrichment. So any data or properties inside of the contact or company that's filling out a form, that's already filled out will automatically be erased from their form. So all they have to do is put in the missing data that they don't have yet. So for example, if you had a form that asked for an email and a phone number and a name, if you already had their name and email, but not the phone number, all I would ask for is the phone number. And you have the option to check that box off, yes or no. Of course, this is a sandbox account, so you need an admin permission to make this happen. If you wanna upgrade, you click on this button, and it'll take you directly to buying 100 monthly credits at $45 a month. As you can see right here, this example that I talked about earlier, the enrich record inside of a company record right here, you can just click this button and it'll fill out all of these properties for you. So on this overview page to show the buyer intent, it has two things. One, it has HubSpot tracking, which is a code that you can install embedded on your website so that it'll match visitor IPs. That way you can kind of see what they're doing and how they're interacting with you. And then the second piece down here is discovering your total market opportunities. So you have to actually address the target market first and you can describe that here. This is your preference so that it actually knows what's a good fit and what's not a good fit with inside of your HubSpot and so that it'll get better over time. Like I said, a lot of this has to do with how well you're actually filling in the details for Breeze because Breeze doesn't quite know exactly what you want yet, but if you fill out all this data with really good details, then it knows exactly the buyer intent that you're looking for so that all of your buyer intent scores are super accurate. On the second piece, you can actually find the direct intent and actions of these companies and contacts and what they're doing to know what is real intent and what's not. So for example, here you can see the number of visits they made at the pricing section on your website. If they made three or more visits, the buying intent is gonna be super direct and super awesome. And you can exclude pages too. If you go to the advanced tracking settings, you can see all of your tracking. So you can have that buyer intent even more solidified. And the last piece right here, like I said, is the form shortening, which I mentioned earlier. And these are all the forms you can make. And those forms will automatically adjust with Breeze as your data enrichment is already filled, it will remove the properties that don't need to be filled out because we already know what they are, making it a better experience for the people that are filling out your forms. So that was a little overview on Breeze Intelligence. Thanks for tuning in, you guys. I'm Tanner with OBO. That was another HubSpot Plus Expert Insights and Hidden Gems video. We'll see you guys next time.